Hello, Namaste, Salam Walaikum, Sastrikal. Welcome back to another session with your washef at wareva.com. Today I am going to make peppered lamb chops. This is not the regular fried kind of lamb chops, but the effect is pretty much same. For this preparation, I need around one and a half tablespoon of oil. I am going to use just half of it, just three fourth spoon of oil. I did not switch on the flame, switch off the cameras. <laughs> Use whole garam masala. I have got cinnamon, cloves and uh, shahi jeera. Add uh, 1 cup uh, chopped onions. Here you can see my chopped onions are slightly brown. And now I am going to add all the ingredients that we need to add here. Ginger garlic paste, curry leaves, turmeric, salt pinch, chilli powder, coconut powder, coriander powder, add all these ingredients, just uh, mix it once and add these lamb chops and add some water, add small amount of water and then put your pressure cooker lid. This is the most simplest preparation you can even make with a regular lamb. In fact, when we get this uh, uh, country chicken, we just make this preparation this way and you cannot go wrong with this dish. Pressure cooker is one of the best ways to cook. Nowadays, I see a lot of advertisements on TV channels telling us to use a pressure cooker so that we save the cooking gas. In India, there is a scarcity of uh, cooking gas, so they've been putting advertisements all over to use methods where you save a lot of these uh, fuels. Now my lamb in a pressure cooker is all ready. I'm just going to take one non-stick pan and add a little bit butter. To this butter, add uh, chopped garlic. Just I crushed it in my ding chick ding chick. Hmm. You don't need to fry this garlic too much, just uh, saute it a little bit. Add pepper powder and uh, some more of uh, curry leaves. This gives a very nice um, flavor to this dish. And now just to transfer all the meat that is there in the pressure cooker. We are going to cook this till this moisture evaporates and uh, you see the traces of little bit uh, oil. I feel really sorry to see this small lamb chops. You know, in US, we used to get lamb chops from New Zealand, huge, big lamb chops. In fact, you should go and see that video of lamb chop fry in YouTube. Now you can see that these lamb chops are oozing out a little bit of oil. That is when these lamb chops are all done. Let this cook in a very slow flame so that this lamb underneath the masala gets slightly brown. That gives an additional flavor to this dish. Just uh, finish it off with a little bit of chopped coriander pinch of garam masala. Look at these awesome peppered lamb chops. Just a sprinkle a little bit of uh, lemon juice. Wow. I am going to... Mm. This is one of the easiest way to make lamb chops. Put all these ingredients just let it cook in a pressure cooker, transfer it into a non-stick pan and just let it cook till the moisture evaporates and you get these excellent lamb chops. Since these lamb chops are so small, do not make it too dry. Let them remain a little bit juicy so that when you eat it, eat the meat and later you can keep all these bones and chew at the end of your lunch or dinner. That's what I do. So dear friends, I hope you enjoyed today's session of cooking these lamb chops peppered fry with your war chef at wareva.com. Remember, Wareva is all about inspiring others to cook. So please post your recipes and cooking tips so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you. Masala chalbon.